What if everyone blew me off and I'm just standing here waiting for nothing and wasting time? Or what if I got myself into? Oh, you gave me a fright! <laughs> Sorry! Hello there. Wait a second. Are you two here for Tempest 6 as well? Yeah, I was expecting that many people to come. Hi everyone! Where did you come from and how did you get here? It's the element of surprise! And I can't reveal, but if you have to know, I jumped off the building. You what? Do you know how high the probability of you getting seriously hurt? Like, 71% high. Eh. Didn't come here to make friends. Right, I better let them in. Every pon- I mean, pet. Ugh, there's not even a signal out here. Let's go! Oh, right. Wow, it's so detailed. Uh. Hey, I'm taking that seat. Ugh. Oh, I, I'm so sorry, you can take the seat. Is this meeting going to start or not? Yes, once Oscar takes a seat and Maximiliano settles down and maybe shows up a bit earlier, we would be in session right now. Uh, sure, Tempest. Very well then. If you are in this room, you have been selected to be a part of a team I call Tempest Six. Each of you have qualities that I find useful for the plan I have. What I want to discuss now is that you have successfully joined this team and should get to know each other more to make our team even stronger. Could you now please introduce yourselves individually to the group? No one? Hi, I'm Lulu! We know. Hmm? I like to have fun, and people tell me I have an enthusiastic personality, so hopefully I can bring that to the team. Hmm? Hello, I like, um, I'm so excited to be part of the squad and have new friends. Oh, and um, my name's Victoria. Um, hey, I'm Paisley. I'll try to be a good team member by listening to your ideas and offering my own when needed. Oh, sorry. Hi, uh, my name's Oscar. I'd like to say I'm good at coding and technology. I am happy to be here. Thank you, Oscar. Would you like to take your turn, Enzo? 
Sure. Hey, I'm Enzo Griffiths. I'm from small town, out of Lulandia. I'll be an asset to the team by always being reliable and loyal. And you, Maximiliano, I believe? Hi, I'm Maximiliano. I get things done. Good to know. Thank you all for introducing yourselves. I'd like to now talk about my plan. The reason I hired you to this group is I want to prove to someone I look up to that I'm ready to take on responsibility again. And the way we are going to do that is... Got it? Yep. Yes. So, I'll need Enzo to get apples and set them up around Sweet Apple Acres. Victoria? I need you to distract Rarity. Paisley? Yes? I need you to plan out every single possibility of our plan working. Oscar? Uh, yeah? I need you to try and hide all of the connections of people interfering and eavesdropping. Lulu to get all the equipment and set it up with the help of Maximiliano at the venue where this all takes place. Got it? Yes! Yeah. Got it? Yeah. Yes! Yep. Yeah! Awesome. We will all recoup again in one hour. See you then. Please don't be late. Maximiliano, wait for me! Why did I trust a bunch of little pets to do this for me? They're taking so long! Oh, uh, Tempest. I thought you had your own things to do. Uh, so, Enzo, did you set up the last of the apples? Yes, I just got back. They're all set up. If my calculations are correct, Applejack should be distracted for 16 minutes and 43 seconds. Which will be just enough time to pull off our biggest prank yet. Celestia will have no idea what hit her when she sees this. <laughs> Hey, Maximiliano. What? The rest of the plan has been all set up. I believe we're all ready to go to stage green. Can you report back? I think this will be valuable information to be known to our chief. Agree. Give me an hour. Your service is very much appreciated. Oh, I'm so sorry, Tempest. May I ask, what made you leave so suddenly? Uh, I just, uh... We need more help with preparing the final prank for Celestia. I thought you were in charge of getting the food for it? I, uh, thought Lulu was doing that. You know, she loves lollies. Look, I don't really care what's going on. I just really need to do this prank to show Celestia I can be good at something. I know, I know. I was there at the interview when you explained this, remember? Right. Anyways... Just don't let me down. Don't worry, I won't. How'd she not realize I was on her computer? I don't know, she seemed like she was in her head. <laughs> I don't remember putting my computer here. Ah! Lulu, you gave me a fright. 
I've been standing here for a while, but I have the balloons all set up. They'll surely steal the show. That's great, Lulu. Thank you. Oh my goodness, I love your earmuffs. I saw you take them off before, but I thought they really went with your outfit. Sorry I'm late, and uh, I, I'll take them off now. I don't think I've ever heard you apologize. I'm so confused on what's happening, and it's fine. You don't do much anyways. If everyone could stop arguing, that would be great. This prank will be ready to launch in three hours, no later. We just need to get to the venue and get Celestia there at the same time. Any thoughts on how we could achieve this? Just tell her to come, it's that easy. And Maximiliano, it's all set up. The plan is we want her to come. That is what makes this even better when she realizes what's actually happening. Okay, then don't ask for my help. Maybe we send her a letter saying it's urgent to get her all worked up. That way, it's quick and efficient for us. We could ask someone to bring her here to make it seem like we weren't even involved, so it's more of a surprise. Why don't we do all? Send a letter to her from another pony who is a unicorn to go to her, then get that unicorn to teleport her to the venue so she gets so caught up to what's going on that she won't think how we are involved. What do you think? It's great. She won't suspect a thing. You guys did so well working together. If only Maximiliano helped. So, who is this unicorn going to be? They'll have to be pretty helpful. Well, who's better than one of Celestia's own teammates? I think the best match is Rarity. She probably isn't too helpful with these kinds of things and won't be noticed as missing. She's the perfect asset to this team. I'll code a letter in Rarity's handwriting and print it out and send it to Celestia to arrive at Rarity's house in a few hours. Yawn first. I'm gonna go outside to get some fresh air. Why did I pick him for this team? So, what did I miss? Well, we're all ready to send the letter to Celestia. We only just announced this a few minutes ago. You're that far ahead? Why didn't you say so? Not really. We've already done most of the plan without you. Just follow me to the limo. I'll bring the trampoline! I can't believe we're getting the limo. You almost forgot your hat, Enzo. And Tempest, you almost forgot your outfit. It was going to make the look. Oh my goodness, it's a unicorn horn? My childhood dreams are coming true. Huh? Hop in, everyone! We are here! Thanks. So, Celestia should be here in 15 minutes, so let's continue setting up the last of the things in our plan. Got it! So excited for this! Ah, oh, Celestia, you are just the one I wanted to see. What was the emergency you needed to see me for? I have no dresses to wear to the Grand Galloping Gala! I don't even know what the theme is! The Grand Golden Gun isn't for another eight months. He still has so long to prepare. I'm going to go. I have duties to attend to. Wait! What is it? Surprise! Surprise! Oh my goodness, is this what I think it is?
It's a surprise party to show you I can be responsible and have good intentions. I want this night to be about celebrating the alicorn in Equestria who does so much for us, who raises the sun every morning and keeps our land stable and peaceful. Thank you so much. This means a lot to me. You're very sweet, Tempest. I don't know. I don't know what to say. <coughs> Apart from that, I knew every single detail about it from the beginning. What are you talking about? I'm confused. Owen, please join me. Owen? <laughs>